The holy man, Philip Neri, offers us an inspiring example of what can happen if we remain in the Lord Jesus and keep the simple commandments that he gave us. From an early age, Philip dedicated himself to a deepening and an intensification of this friendship he had with the Lord. As a young adult, he spent countless hours in prayer in the catacombs in Rome. He stayed with the Lord and Jesus drew him closer and nourished him, sending the Holy Spirit into his heart in a very unique and profound way. So that time that he spent with the Lord in prayer ended up preparing him for the great work that he would undertake later, which was nothing less than converting, reconverting Rome to Christ one person at a time. And he could not have done what he did. He, he, there's no way he could not have become a great saint if he had not first remained in the Lord and discovered the joy that comes from that deepening friendship. So the more Philip remained with the Lord, the more he flourished. St. Philip Neri is just one example that the church gives us. We have even more contemporary examples in, say, Blessed Mother Teresa, Blessed John Paul II, people whose joy in the Lord many of us have witnessed with our own eyes. Every one of us is looking for happiness, the real joy in living. Unfortunately, we sometimes look in the wrong places. But we know where to find the prize, both in this life and in the next. His name is Jesus Christ. And he has called us to his friendship, and he has proven that friendship to us when he hung on the cross. So remain in his love.